The work I've developed for Art Loves You is titled The Language of Light uh, and it's an in-depth exploration that I'm looking at my practice in the way that colour, how colour makes us feel and the therapeutic relationship to colour and ourselves as a community. So by looking at this work what I've done is break down colour to resonate with a particular point in the body. So to help the person or the audience or the participant engage in that there's also sound and scent to help correlate and ground the person in the space. So it becomes a full immersive experience. Um, so you can move from one colour to the next and take your time and be immersed in the sensation chamber and really feel how that affects you as an experiential work of art. Art to me is my way of being useful. Uh, it's my particular skill set that I have in the world. Um, so I very much look at how I can be pivotal in making a difference through the vehicle of art. The way I like to work is in the social practice aspect, which means uh, working with other communities or other people and looking at the collaborative approach to art making and positioning that as the artwork itself, uh, so that when a work is realised that it's a collaborative experience and a collaborative narrative and not just a single point perspective from myself. I think that art works or exhibition like Art That Loves You are incredibly important uh, and I think that it's really timely um, at this point to see the connections between contemporary art uh, and other relationships to community and to education and to health. So by positioning works that people can come into the gallery and feel like they're a part of uh, and understand in terms of the well-being that's behind them or the therapeutic process or the educational value that it offers is a huge contribution to a community at this point in time.